good morning everybody okay so this is just an alternative that's like an emergency alternative i had to create this video today a day before day three it's like to, today's day two of the cp7 class already i had to create this video immediately so that while you're waiting for gig pay honestly speaking when i created the video for gig pay immediately you 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 verify your account make you submit for verification it's always fast but i don't know why it's taking quite long but i can assure you in between okay i can't really give you so much assurance but based on previous other like apps now it's always usually in between two to three days you understand so if you check again two to three days your documents must have been verified and for payday, please, every error that happens that is going on on payday currently is going to be is going to be rectified this week. Okay, that's what usually happens. If they have a problem, they usually take like two to three days and do very do do fix it up. So just don't worry. This video I'm going to create now is going to, this video I'm creating is going to get you covered while you're waiting for those two apps to respond. Okay, so now we proceed into the video. So first you're going to go to your play store and then you're going to this is how your play store is going to look like i'm going to try and make this video fast so you're going to type gray g-r-e-y g-r-e-y and then this is the app icon okay then you install it and then this is how it's going to be so you click create account you fill in your details first name middle name last name your phone number you, you change the country code here from plus one to plus two three four Plus two three four is Nigeria, and then you type your number here. Then you enter your password, and then you click next. Then you verify your email. They have sent an OTP to your mail, so you're just going to go to Gmail. Then you see it here. Confirm your identity. Okay, so you call, when you open that email, confirm your identity. This is what you're going to see. Okay, so you now carry, you now copy this code, and then bring it back here and put it. Then you click verify account. So they'll now tell you okay finish your account setup so you put your home address exactly as it is on your bank statement okay you put your country you put your state your city you put your zip code from the previous video i showed you how to find your zip code remember you just go on google type the zip code for your state you understand and that zip code is what you're going to come and put here then your utility bill is your um driver and um, your utility bill is your bank statements that you're going to upload here so you can upload it as pdf as png as jpg as jpeg any format you have you can upload it here then you select your date of birth then your date of birth then you select your gender select your occupation then purpose for signing up on gray you can choose anyone from the list but just like the one that actually suits you i think i'll you i'll, I'll advise you to prefer to choose freelancer okay so you now click sorry not freelancer to receive funds to receive my funds or if you see freelancers the options i created this long ago okay so you now click next then almost there then this, this is where you're going to do your verification so we are required by law to verify your identity before you can begin making transactions on gray so you're going to need any of these documents you have here so you click next and then they'll answer let's verify your identity to get verified you will need to upload the documents proving your identity please i beg in the name of god please if you want this to be fast great they actually reply very fast this one i verified it today today as i'm making this video now i verified it to be sure okay this thing is actually going to work and they actually their response time is extremely fast so make sure that the document you're providing is clear make sure that when you're recording the selfie it is also in a clear room and see the aim of everything is just to make sure that your face from the self is matching the face in the document if the face in the document cannot be seen you're not going to get verified okay so you have to make sure both of them are clear so you're now going to choose the country please people from cameroon and ghana okay so people from cameroon and ghana i am really really sorry after this video i'm going to be sending another alternative for you this one should work for you but for gray it's only for nigerians currently okay so nigerians this video is for you for people for my for participants from cameroon and ghana 
I'm going to be sending another alternative after this one. Okay, so now you select anyone you select here. If you select an iron slip or whatever you're selecting here, remember it has to be clear. It has to be very, very clear. So what next? You now take a photo of it. If you have it on your gallery, you can you can upload it. If you have a photo already, like if you have it physically, you can snap it there. Just make sure that it is very clear. Then they'll now tell you once once you're done with this, you now take a selfie of yourself. Remember, you have to be in a light, a lit room, and your face has to show very clearly. Then you now tell your verification data has been received. Click done to continue. You now click done. You now say you're all set up. Your registration is now complete and your verification is being reviewed. Once verified, you can request to get a foreign account. So you click proceed to dashboard and then you set up your PIN. Once you set up your PIN, they'll show you seen PIN created successfully. Then you click proceed to dashboard. So initially, you see KYC submission has been received. So you're just going to wait for highest 13 minutes. Great, they reply very fast and they respond very fast. They'll tell you what the problem is immediately, whether the thing is not clear or, or something. So once you're done, you check your email and you see this, your KYC has been approved. Congratulations. So once you're done, that's this thing that was here will now disappear. Okay. So now the next thing that you're going to do now, you now come here, click request a foreign account, and then you now have to choose. So you choose GBP. You're going to be choosing GBP. Okay, not Euro GBP. So when you choose GBP, you should wait like let's say the same 30 minutes, but it will give you at a shorter time. I'm just giving 30 minutes as an estimated value. So when you click GBP, your details will be shown like this. Then you can go back to Amazon KDP, then fill it the same way. So please remember one thing you should note, and I said it in the video: Swift code is the same thing as BIC code. Okay, BIC code is the same thing as Swift code. So when you're when you're uploading, when you're inputting your details in Amazon KDP, you would be guided. Okay, so this is definitely going to work. Okay, be shortly, like some minutes before I made this video, I tested again for the third time. So it's definitely going to work. But if it doesn't work for you, you can always come and meet me and complain to me. You see, everybody complained to me that okay had a problem and i created an alternative immediately that's how i am if you make a complaint to me i try to solve your problem immediately okay so this was not this is like an emergency video it was not planned okay so please payday users people that are trying to assess payday and are having issues just please be patient for now okay for your bank details you can be using this one for now payday they are going to get right they are going to rectify every issue this week gig pay you should just wait three to like between 24 to 48 hours and you're going to get your account details or you and you're going to get your bank verified your account verified and get your account details so for now just use this one okay thank you very much have a wonderful morning i still remain coach promise